The Nobel Prize in Physiology and Medicine for the year 2024 has been awarded to scientists Victor Ambrose and Gary Ruvikun for the discovery of microRNA and its role in post transcriptional gene regulation. Now, their work helped explain how cells specialize and develop into different types such as muscle and nerve cells, even though all the cells in an individual contain the same set of genes and instructions for growing and staying alive. Announcing the decision to honor Ambrose and Ruvikin, the Nobel Assembly said that their discovery is proving to be fundamentally important for how organisms develop and function. Ambrose is a professor at the University of Massachusetts Medical School, while Ruvikin is a professor at Harvard Medical School and also affiliated with Massachusetts General Hospital in Boston. Speaking at an event, Ruvikin acknowledged that Nobel is a class in its own. He took a moment to tell his life story, how he was nothing but a disappointment in his early 20s, living in a van and traveling third-class buses. And so, you know, there's, um, but then in Cochabamba, Bolivia, I was bored with travel and I went to the Bolivian American friendship, something or other, there's probably a CIA front and they had, they had scientific American magazines and I spent a day reading scientific American and it was really a good day. And I said, you know what, maybe I'll go to graduate school. And so I came to Harvard for graduate school and that was, was 76. In a separate event, Ambrose said he was astonished and delighted on winning the prize and attributed his success to his immigrant lineage. He talked about the struggles of his father. So he got to go to, um, you know, uh, to um, gymnasium in, in Vilnius, you know, uh, for a couple of years until the war started. And then he was homeless for a year and a half. You know, and then he was captured by uh, the Nazis and, and, and he worked as a slave laborer, you know, in a factory for a few years. You know, and then he befriended, uh, he was liberated and then befriended some people in the, in the occupying U.S. Army, one of whom became his very close friend and sponsored his immigration to the States. And so that's, that's how, how I'm here. The winners of the prize for physiology or medicine are selected by the Nobel Assembly of Sweden's Karolinska Institute Medical University and receive a prize sum of $1.1 million.